Oh, See you, Amy. Thanks, Thanks, Thanks for having us. Yeah, <laughs> safe Good luck. Take care. Bloop, bloop, bloop. <laughs> Super late start today, but we're off to Stanford. Kelsey, we're coming for you. Kelsey, is that you? Is that you? You're all orange. Yeah. What's that from? Swimming. Swimming? <laughs> you doing? You swimming again? Yeah, I started swimming because I can't weight lift anymore. Oh man. <laughs> This is so overwhelming. Just wanted to come back and ask for the honor to be Thank you. Yellow or white? Can I have uh, five egg whites? Okay, so <laughs> egg white can eat me? Uh, chicken? Cheese? No cheese. Thank you. Oh, oh my favorite. And then there's like in there, so you like smash it up and you just put it in there too. Oh my god. Do you want to put like a fruit? Yeah, let's do it. Make me your specialty. My specialty is not the other diet. Is the what? Like, my favorite waffles, they have like a puree of blueberries. But you just want to split it with fruit. Kelsey's gonna make me a, a banana strawberry waffle. Yes. We're gonna Crazy. Oh man. Because I see the guy still there. They go check periodically. Okay, I'll go check on it right now. Man, look at her go. I always spell it, but I don't care. <laughs> I was gonna say it. That's a big ass waffle, Kelsey. I don't know. I like it when it spills because it makes it really crunchy on the sides. Oh. And the timer's broken, so we'll have to just count two minutes. Okay. All right, let's go check on there. Yeah. Look at this omelet. Majestic. You want to, maybe later. Let's hang on. Look at this thing. Oh my god. How many eggs? Five? How do, how do we know? Like this is this looks like crazy. It looks like we destroyed the whole machine. We're inside Stanford's yeah, Commons. <laughs> wow, I was kidding. Wait, what is this Commons called? Oh, um, Wilbur. Okay, so we're inside Wilbur <laughs> Commons. I got this majestic omelet. It's all egg whites. Five egg whites with chicken, onion, bell peppers, mushrooms, and a whole other bunch of things. It looks really big, but it's just all vegetables. And Kelsey made me her Stanford waffle special. This, this is really cool. It has the little like Stanford logo thing right there. So one of my favorite desserts is crepes. Kelsey's gonna make that for me right now. Make it happen, Kelsey. Oh. <laughs> oh, no, 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 no. Damn, you're a professional. Yeah. You're a professional. So Kelsey made me a crepe. It's right there. Boom, there's, there's strawberries. Soft serve, whipped cream, and Nutella. I don't know if you guys saw that. Yeah. <laughs> Thank you. My dorm is literally right there. <laughs> Ooh, it's super What's it called? Uh, Ricolada. Oh my god, it's literally oh, right there. <laughs> literally right there. Our dorm is nicknamed Drinkanada. Oh. Yeah. Uh -huh. I don't drink though. <laughs> you literally like don't have to go anywhere. Welcome to my crew. Thank you. So this is the computer, like we're allowed to go in here and use the computers, whatever. I okay. Still, I still pay for something. 
This is our kitchen, but it's locked up because people don't clean. Because <laughs> people don't clean. This is my roommate's bed, though. Dang, I miss dorming. Okay. Okay. Wait, let me turn that one on. <laughs> Ta-da! Dang! It just flashes. So do you do that when you uh, want to piss off your roommate or something? No! <laughs> I do like, you like, like, you like sleep. Oh, you trying to study? <laughs> you trying to sleep? <laughs> let me, so let mean. me flash you. <laughs> Oh my gosh, look at, this is when I graduated and Kelsey graduated high school. Look at Kelsey's face. Ah! <laughs> this is so cool. She has like all these photos on her wall. And we're about to get a tour of Stanford's campus, courtesy of my assistant Kelsey. I think we're going to this H Hubert Hoover, it begins with the H, H Tower. We're going to H Tower and apparently you can see the entire campus from this tower. I wish I had like a better zoom lens, but this 18 by 55 will have to do. <laughs> yeah, it was definitely worth the wait. You guys ready to go back up? Yeah, let's go. We got inside Stanford gym. Thank you, Kelsey. You're welcome. Woo. So that means we're gonna finally have gym footage. I'm gonna bring you a full back and bicep days featuring the one and only. Get the white ones. Damn. First set, five sets of six to ten pull-ups. She's doing assisted, so if you can't do real pull-ups, get a band and do it. I like the band over assisted pull-up machines because the band lets you move in the real pull-up motion whereas the machine is fixed and you have to work with the machine versus actually doing a real pull-up. <laughs> oh, no. Wow. Bye, Kelsey. Thanks for taking us here. Next move, single arm dumbbell rows. What we're gonna do is, most people will just do dumbbell rows straight up and down. We're gonna add this forward motion and row it up. So you can make a J for Jeremy. J for Jeremy. But the reason being is because your lats don't run straight up and down. They actually run this way as well. So when you're rowing, you want that forward extension. So if you check out her form, She's letting the weight roll forward and then she's pulling it back that way in a J motion. So, up forward, J. Bam. Alright, next move is going to be lap pull downs. So, when you're doing lap pull downs, too wide is actually a bad thing and too close, you may not be hitting what you want exactly. There's a sweet spot and it's different for everyone. For me, my rule of thumb is grab right where the, the bend starts. It's gonna be different for everyone, but I like to start right there, so. 
I'll do it right here. Yeah, this part is a little closer, so I'm gonna actually do a thumb this part. And pull straight down. You don't you don't wanna be back. You don't want to be excessively forward straight down. It's a lap pull down, not a lap pull forward or a lap pull back. Let's get it. Next move, I have no idea what it's called, but Fluff Chronicles, the 2016 Barcelona Cast kind of Spokes model introduced this to me, so we'll call it the Fluff Special. Basically, it's a lap movement. You're gonna grab the bar like this, extend as far back as you can. You want your back rounded for this, and you want a lighter weight. I can't move it. I'm gonna start. I'm gonna start at 25 to just wait. feel it out. Start here. Extend as far back as you can. And that's here. You're gonna pull, and as you pull, rotate your arm out that way. It might even be better if you cross your leg over it. Just... Nadia didn't like the bench seat over there, so what we did was we propped the dumbbell here. She's using her leg to find balance on the bench, and now she's doing the rotation movement like this. There you go, come all the way forward, let it pull you. And then, boom, there you go. Nice. All right, next back movement. So all our previous back movements were a lot of lateral, long lateral movements. So what we're gonna do now is work on the center of the traps thing. Bring it down this way. And to do that, we're gonna do this rowing motion. We're gonna hop on the hammer string. We're gonna grab up here and row it straight back. Uh, let me see. To demo. Yeah. So typically for back movements, if you're if you're rowing out wider like this, you're gonna be working on your lats, and the closer you grip and row towards center, the more traps you're gonna engage. That's what we're doing right now. Let's get it. All right, next move, we're gonna do spider curls, basically. I have no idea why it's called this, but you're gonna set a bench up on incline and you're gonna be facing the bench and your body's gonna be on it. So what's gonna happen is gravity's gonna push you down and there's no way to rock back and forth. It's gonna be all biceps. do one more move for arms and that's gonna be hammer curls so there's no right or wrong way to do this really but rule of thumb you're either gonna want to drive the dumbbell up to your chest or to the opposite side of your chest either way you're still working the same part of your bicep let's get it How was your workout? Woo! <laughs> it's 
super excited to get a workout in with the bay. It's been so long since we worked out together, right? Mm -hmm. How long has it been? Probably like a year. A year? Jeez. Yeah, so we got a workout in. Thank you again, Kelsey, for hooking it up at Stanford. This is a super nice facility. Look, they, let me give you guys a quick tour. I mean, you already saw the gym, but here's, here's their rock climbing thing. Check it out, it's like an actual rock climbing gym. Look at that. Holy. I think ours only goes up to like, right here. Peace out, Stanford. Oh guys, check out their pool. This is ridiculous. It's freaking awesome. There's like people just tanning out over there. I can't believe they have a grass area for that too. This is legit. You guys want abs? That's the secret. Rice and crazy.